Luna 4 was launched on April 2nd, 1963 at 8.04 a.m. UTC from Gagarin's start at Baikonur Cosmodrome. Flying on the Molnia L rocket, it was the first attempt to make a soft landing on the moon as opposed to an impactor like the Ranger probes. Two previous attempts to launch this style of lunar probe had occurred in January and February of 1963, but the lunar transfer stage on the first failed to ignite and a second didn't even reach orbit. Luna 4 reached orbit and made its transfer to the moon, but missed it at a distance of 8,336 kilometers because it failed to do a mid-course correction. After Luna 4, four more attempts either failed to make orbit or didn't make the transfer, until Luna 5 launched two years after this launch, which ended up impacting the moon because its retro engine failed to fire. With Luna 6, the engine continued to fire during the mid-course correction, burning through all its fuel instead of stopping. Luna 7 lost attitude control right before its retro burn to land on the lunar surface, as did Luna 8. Finally, Luna 9 would succeed in making a soft landing on the moon, having essentially the same design as Luna 4, but without the bugs. It did so on January 31st, 1966, an arduous two years and ten months after this launch. Luna 4 was a complicated spacecraft with a lunar transit mass of 1,580 kilograms, of which 99 kilograms was the landing capsule with a camera, antenna, and a radiation detector. The capsule was shaped like an egg and had petals that would fold out once it was safely on the ground. It was actually ejected from the rest of the spacecraft once contact with the ground was detected and had airbags to protect it after ejection. The rest of the spacecraft body had the retro rocket and liquid fuel to slow its approach to the lunar surface, vernier thrusters and nitrogen attitude jets to control its orientation, the ground contact probe, and two large modules strapped to the side, one containing the radar altimeter and another with an astronomical orientation system. Although Luna 4 was a failure, it showed that at this stage the Soviet Union was much more ambitious with its lunar missions than the United States, largely bolstered by the high lifting capacity of its R-7 family rockets. The Molnia L could launch the 1.5 ton Luna 4 to the moon while the Ranger probes were riding on Atlas Agenas that could only send 390 kilograms, preventing them from having the fuel to make a soft landing. It would take the development of the cryogenic Centaur stage for the United States to land its surveyor probes on the moon, and the use of liquid hydrogen fueled engines was a major component in the success of the subsequent American missions to the moon. On that note, thank you for watching this mission profile of Luna 4.